Howdy everyone, Pocha here with an Age of Magic video, and in today's video we are going to be taking on the Demon King himself, the big boy and his big old sword, we're going to beat that thing down, okay? That is our goal. I've been meaning to do this video for a long time, but um, I've just had a lot of things going on, and I apologise, but it's all good now, I'm happy, and we are going to, yeah, I've, wanted, I've been wanting to do it for a long time. Anyway, we're going to fight the most common Abaddon team out there, it consists of Abaddon, Succubus, Zar, Zariel, and Lucky. So it's essentially a holy trinity, um, but instead of the rock, they've got a yeah, big boy, big boy demon king. So I have also been requested to try and beat this team without a Sacrif, and I am going to comply to that, because I understand Sacrif can be quite a difficult champion to get for a lot of people. So, yeah. I have figured out a team. It is pretty good. It has a pretty high success rate. Uh, when versing the team, I'll show you why I picked that team and the reasons for it right now. Here we go. We're going to use Lucky, Azari, or Mabe, Cage, and Raspit. Now, the reason I want to use this team is for a very specific reason. I picked characters that cannot AoE. My aim is not to damage um, the big boy, Abaddon. Anyway, I'm not going to explain it. I'll explain it in the battle. So we'll head on over, we'll beat him, and... Hopefully it helps everyone. So like I mentioned, our aim is not to hit Abaddon. I don't want to aim him at all. I, I'm going to let him do his stuff, okay? But what we are going to do is our first move is going to be locking down Zart. That is it. That is our first move. Now, the reason why we want to do this is because Zart will heal. And if he heals, he puts a dot on everyone. And he puts a dot on Abaddon. And if Abaddon loses health, it triggers his passive, which forces us to attack the champion with the highest HP, which is not what we want to do. We are going to kill Lucky. That is our next goal. We're going to anti-heal her. We've got the dot on her. We're going to use our Lucky's heal, and then they're going to get all their abilities off, and then we can double strike. We didn't get the double strike on Lucky, but that's fine. Zart gets his abilities. Uh, not Zart. Um, Abaddon uses his abilities, and I'm happy that he's locked some of our champions down, because I'm going to prove to you right now that this team can still win. Our next target is going to be Zart. We need to get rid of Zart, because we do not want him healing, we do not want him resurrecting, we do not want him doing anything, and I'm pretty sure my passive is up. That's good. But it blocks... So we really, really, really... Actually, we're really lucky. Lucky does not have the anti-heal on her. So, yeah, obviously there is a bit of RNG to this battle, okay? But, um, on the most part, we should be pretty sweet. So now we can take out the enemy Zart. There we go. Lucky dies, Zart dies, everything's falling into place. Our next target is Succubus. So we are going to kill Succubus here. Put the poison on. I'm not hiding my... Cage, I know some people get really triggered by that. They're like, why don't you hide your cage? Hiding cage, to me, is a situational thing. I don't hide him if I don't need to. Like, I'd rather just... Like, right now, why would I hide him when I can? I know I can kill... Um, when I know I can nearly kill the succubus? Um, then we'll move on to... The Azariel. So we can choose to... Is he going to lock us down? She's not. He, she. Uh, what do we want to do here? What can he do? He can't do anything either. He's just going to hit us. What can she do? She can't really do anything either. Do I want to waste? No, I don't want to waste it. We're just going to auto attack. Auto attack. He dies. Wonderful. And then what do we want to do? That's going to come up. So we're going to reset Abaddon's uh, initiative. And we can actually just kill him here. We're not in a great spot, but we can top ourselves off with um, Azariel. So let's put the anti-healing on Azariel. Alright, uh, and we are pretty much set from this point on. Poison Azariel. Double the poison. Oh, not double, but... Increase the percentage of damage she takes. Take her out, and Abaddon dies. And that's the fight. I've done this battle several times now. Sometimes you can destroy that that team. It, I, you know, I lost the battle with... I didn't lose the battle, but I came out of the battle with my characters not being at full HP. But 
I've had times where I've just destroyed the Abaddon team so quickly, and I've had times where, you know, I've come really close to losing, or I have even lost. Um, Abaddon's just one of those champions where it is a bit RNG, but I, I think this team is quite safe to use, if you use it properly, um, and you aren't scared to, you know, leave Abaddon up for a tiny bit. It's just the way, yeah. Anyway... I hope this has helped you guys. Um, I know some people are struggling with Abaddon, and this is just a, a fun little team that isn't super hard to get to beat him, and um, it doesn't require Sakurif. So I think I've met all the, the winning conditions there, boys and girls. Anyway, ladies and gents, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. I'll answer to the best of my ability, and wherever you are in the world, until next time, take care of yourself.